In this episode, we are going to talk about corporate financial reporting. We have many corporate clients and they come from different regions and industries. Over the years, we have found that their financial requirements are very similar. And here are the key foundations that every customer is requiring for their financial reporting. Number one, flexibility in creation and usage of financial statement. Number two, support for local and corporate currency in the same application. Number three, support for calendar date and fiscal date. And number four, ability to consolidate the data across all legal entities and all financial dimensions that are available in Dynamics. Let's see how it works in practice. Financial statements are created with tabular editor connected to tabular model. They come in a form of calculation groups and each financial statement line is one calculation item. When we deploy and publish this, let's see what we get in BFO Dynamics. We're looking for calculation group table. Let's say this one. And here is the row definition of our calculation statement. Now, because this is a part of our financial module, we can connect and bring in any dimensions that we want. So for example, date, company. Also, if we bring into more financial dimensions, if we purely focus on general ledger transactions, we can see that all these dimensions are available. So for example, we bring in department, here it goes, or financial, any other financial dimensions. It's not a problem. Now, one super important feature is that we can nest the GL account, which is very convenient as we do not have to go to that many details in our original financial statement, which is usually a very common situation and you come up with 50 or 100 lines. Now we can do all kind of uh, time intelligence comparison that I have one example already here. Need change here today, variance. And also because this is either Excel or Power BI, we can also do the formatting. So we can see here why December is good with a lot of revenue, May was not that good. And we can do all kind of formatting that you would like to do. So let's just do the formatting. We can further show also that going into the details, this is financial statement line, we can focus on particular part of financial statement and it goes to a document or in our case, a voucher level. So top bottom approach with just few clicks. What is very good also that it provides an excellent base for visualization as we can define also KPIs that are not only summary of GL accounts, but also formulas. And with this line definition, we can create very appealing dashboards. And as explained before, use it with any limited financial dimensions. Another very important feature is when you have international business, how you are going to analyze the businesses which are not in the same currency. Because you have local currency and then BFO Dynamics provides additional currency for the reporting. So in our case, when we have a company, for example, this is all in US dollar because it's a US dollar as a selected company. But what if I choose all the companies that they have here, like 15, 20 companies, this is no longer valid. So we replace the GL need change with corporate or reporting currency and all the transactions have been transferred with the exchange rate last available. And now I can do this analysis through corporate accounts. So this is all in one, very simple to set up, very simple to navigate, while very, very, very powerful.